Hello guys, how are we doing? Welcome back to the Free Amazon. This is a very quick review of the West Ham versus Chelsea game that has just finished 1 0 to Chelsea. Um, after a really frustrating game, um, the injuries are really starting to hot up now. Um, you know, the lineup was obviously Fredericks coming at left wing back. Um, the lineup was fairly predictable apart from that. Balbuena coming in for um, Dawson, who was suspended for the game. Uh, they lined up as expected, you know, Kante, Mount, Werner, um, all the top dogs in there. They put the big big defenders in, you know, to deal with our set pieces, which they did do very, very well. Um, we enjoyed quite a lot of possession, but there was nothing, you know, we didn't offer anything um, going forward. You know, there was no focal point. Um, you know, we, we are really missing pace. Antonio, you know, scares any defender. And, you know, offers a different dynamic. Declan Rice to just do that little bit of dirty work and carry the ball from midfield um, is obviously, you know, holding Socek back at the moment because obviously Socek can't make those runs because he has to do Noble's running at the moment. Um, like I say, I thought we dealt with them quite well, though. We were sort of, um, you know, they're very renowned for their, you know, their diagonal balls into the full uh, the bombing fullbacks and the, the wingers. And we, we were dealing with that quite well. Um, and for points in this first half, we you know we was quite on top, but really never offered anything of any any merit. Like there's nothing that really sticks out that we did we did um, that really sort of threatened. Um, obviously, their goal came, and it, it was an absolute banker that he was going to score. But whenever you're going for a dry patch of of all the years I've supported West Ham, uh, you come to West Ham and you're going to get yourself a goal. Uh, to be fair to Werner, I thought he was excellent today, you know, he kept popping up in positions and even when he weren't doing the right thing, you know, or just missing dodgy, because he did do a really bad miss a little bit after that uh, in the second half. But um, obviously he got his goal, uh, came from the side, just, I don't know what Diop was doing. Um, it was just a little bit of laziness in defence, but yeah, 1-0 down, it's just an unfortunate time that we conceded because we was a bit on top at that time. Uh, but just didn't manage to score. Uh, second half came, no changes, um, straight early doors. Um, we started okay. We, we, you know, Chelsea were quite slow. They were, you know, they were sort of just passing it around the back, but with no real zip. Um, and then Werner had his chance that he missed off the mount, forced a good save from Fabianski. Forced a couple of good saves, man. He, what, what a player he is! What a fantastic footballer Mason Mount is. Um, we, we just, I don't know, it just the final ball was letting us down a lot, but Bowen was getting in good positions, but the final ball for now was a couple of times the final ball. Um, it's just frustrating, just frustrating. Like I say, there's just not, just no killer today. There was nothing to kill, uh, nothing to be a killer. I did think we defended very, very well, though. I thought, you know, for long spells in that game, we, de we we didn't look really in, in danger at all, you know. There's like I say, a couple of times when Chelsea got for a bit, it was nothing major. Um, and obviously, the, the main talking point going to be of the game now, guys, is the Balbuena one. What the hell was that? What, what was the referee thinking? Are you not allowed to clear a football now? So the ball was obviously played, you know, it came to him and he, he just cleared it. And obviously, he, his foot has followed through and hit, um, was it Rodiga, was it? I can't remember it was if he actually went down the side of him. I, I apologise for whoever it was. It might have been Pulisic. Um, absolute joke. Absolute joke of a decision. I knew, we all know, as soon as the referee going over to the screen, it's going to be a red card. We've had the one with Socek. We've had the one with um, Balbuena today. And then the, the fact that Sofell did the same thing later on, about 10 minutes later in the game. And, you know, there was no, there was no, he wasn't told to go over and look at the screen. That, inconsistency there was the one with Liverpool earlier with the handball um, and there was one in our game today with a handball if the Callum Wilson one's handball earlier that was disallowed that absolute quite a one's handball for the penalty uh, and I don't listen I, I, it's a harsh penalty but if that's what you're giving a penalty for what you're disallowing a goal for then that's how it is um, Chelsea deserved the win though you know, just purely because we didn't have anything else, really. We didn't have no attacking threat. And again, I think we are going to be punished now, you know, for not, for too many injuries and, you know, not buying a striker and not having, you know, enough bodies when, when we could have gone for it. Um, I think top four might just be out of our reach now. Um, just hopefully we don't capitulate too much and, like, don't end up, you know, no European football at all. That would be really devastating. But... Um, 
yeah, very, very disappointing. Obviously, three points away from the top four now. Chelsea have got some tough, tough games, and we've got favourable games from now on. Um, but, yeah, it's going to be tough. It's going to be tough. We need some players back now. We need Rice back. You know, we need Masawaku, Cresswell. Cresswell should be back for the next game. We need these players back now for these last five games that are left, and maybe we've got a chance, but it's going to be really, really tough. Anyway, guys, let me know what you think about the game. Um, just a short review, very, very quick, short and sweet. Until next time, guys, come on your minds, keep believing, let's go.